Hi guys, it's me Lewis and I'm here to talk about Riptide GP Renegade that's just been announced uh, last night um, on their Facebook page and Twitter and also on their website of course. Um, Vecti this is the most unexpected thing, uh, uh, well the un most unexpected IP um, from Vector Unit. Um, I, was, I was not expecting a new Riptide GP game to be announced this early but wow I'm not too quite surprised. But um... So yeah, they, they've announced they've announced this last night, and there's a lot of stuff. And the, the, well, that's, there's quite a few things I need to talk about. It. Um, they, they haven't got a release date for the game just yet. It's still in develop. It's still in development. Um, at first, I saw, I saw a screenshot of this, and I thought, "Hang on, is this, is this like a new map or something? A new a new map for Riptide GP2?" But no, it's, it's a new it's a new IP, a new uh, a new IP into the Riptide GP series. Um, and since it's called Riptide GP Renegade. Obviously, uh, renegade means you know uh, outlaw. You, 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 you want to be, you want to, um, you know, roam free. You know, cause so much chaos and destruction. And I'm looking at this screenshot right now on on, on, my, on my Facebook, which I'll put in the in the description, by the way. And wow, I it looks it, it looks so cool, man. I have to say, it looks really awesome. Um, but the jet skis really catch my eye because they look so gorgeous and so well done. I'm just like. How how does Vector Unit make make a, make a series or a game that good like Riptide G, like Riptide GP and the Beach Buggy series? Um, that that's that's beyond me. But I'm just like wow, they're, they're so damn good. They 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 know how to make a racing game. It's 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 unbelievable. Um, but the way I'm looking at the screenshot, it looks like to me since it's called Renegade, you're being chased by cops. So it's so it's like you know you're taking it in the streets. Um, well you're like taking it. But well, you're basically like racing around the city uh, illegally. That is illegal racing, um, jet ski, jet ski street racing, as you might want to call it. <laughs> but I'm looking at the description on this photo, and turns out there's going to be mini games. And get ready, for, and get ready for this pass. Online multiplayer for the console versions of of this game. Fa finally, we're actually going to get a game from Vector Unit that's going to have full online multiplayer. That's going to keep me occupied for. For a very long time, uh, along along with the other games that, that I'm going to get uh, later on in the future, and um, yeah, it's, to, to be honest with you, I, I will I will put a lot of like um, Riptide GP and Vector Unit uh, related related links in the description if you guys want to go and check that out. If you want to buy a T-shirt from them, I'll put that I'll put I'll, I'll put that in the description as well. Go and go and buy a T-shirt from them because that that'll give so much so much su support. Vector Unit. I have to say the designs of, of, of the racetracks, the environments, the the vehicles, the that heli that police helicopter, it looks insane. It really does. I, I when I saw this last night, I was just like, that was my reaction. My jaw just dropped. I was like, a new game, from, a new IP from back to unit, a new Riptide GP game. I'm just like, eh? it, it took me, it took me around like ten minutes to get my head around it. I'm not joking yet. It took me like ten bloody minutes, and I was just like, um, what? What? I was literally confused. I was like, hang on, are they actually taking this in the streets this time? And it turns out they are. They're actually taking um, the Riptide GP series into the streets, similar to Sons of Neva Speed, Most Wanted, crossed with Wave Race. That's been that's been pretty much what this game is. Um, they haven't got they haven't released a, a trailer for this game just yet, even though the game is still development. You know, they still need to work on it. Um, don't worry, back to you. Now. I will I will react to your uh, I will react to the trailer if it, once you once you've like you know uh, uploaded it to YouTube and Facebook and Twitter and stuff like that. You get you get the idea. Um, but yeah, I I literally am quite impressed to see that you know. Uh, that, you know, the Riptide GP series is actually one of Vector Unit's best-selling um, games ever, ever when they made, when they developed it. Because, um, you know, Riptide GP 1 was so popular on uh, on Android and iOS, on iOS devices. Um, then, he moved on, then he moved on to porting over to the PC and... Um, and I think I think also the Nvidia Shield. I think they ported. I think they ported Riptide GP2 to the Nvidia Nvidia Shield. I'm trying to remember. I think, I think they did. Uh, but yeah, so, and, and yeah, they brought Riptide GP2 to, to uh, as next gen. Well, this this gen this gen's consoles now. Uh, Xbox One, Xbox One, and PS4. Um, they have confirmed that it will come to Xbox One, PS4, of course, and also PC, which is obviously no surprise. Um, they haven't got a release date. They haven't got a release date for for the for for, for Android or iOS. Um, 
released just yet. That, that that's that's one thing that I think a lot. I think you know if 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 if, if you want to do if you want to do mobile gaming, which I'm not which I'm not really fully into, you know you can you can just go you can just you know you're gonna have to wait for that one. Um, if you have a PC, then you might as well just get on PC. So yeah. <laughs> But yeah, I'm I'm truly I'm happy that this game is getting online multiplayer. They, I'm honestly people have been asking Vector Unit for online multiplayer for Riptide GP two and Beach Boogie Racing for quite some time. Um, don't 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 get me wrong, don't get me wrong. Beach Boogie Racing, Riptide GP two are brilliant games. Problem is, is that you know you the problem is you know online multiplayer is what keeps people occupied for a very long time, and and when when I when they were when they were like um, I think they. Yeah, they were they were on Twitch, I think, a few months back, and um, and they said that uh, I, I asked them a question saying that you know um, why why hasn't Riptide GPC got online multiplayer? And they said because they had a lot of trouble trying to trying to run online online servers. They were trying to, like you know try, they were trying to like, get the net coding right. They had a lot of trouble with that, so they so they had to like cut it out. Um, unfortunately, for those two games. But now, finally, a Riptide GP game that I can I I, I probably am going to enjoy, considering that you have. Um, these crazy ass looking jet skis. I'm not kidding you. They look they look way, they look way more better than the than than the jet skis in Riptide GB2. I'm not kidding you. If you if you have if you have Riptide GB2, and if you're seeing the screenshot right now, you can easily tell the difference. Um, but me, I I I'm personally I'm excited for this game, but at the same time, I I need, I need to know what the gameplay is going to be like because you know, obviously, you know, a screenshot's not going to fully convince me. It does look, it does look really, it does look really nice, it does look gorgeous and all that. But at the same time, I need to make sure I need, I need to see the gameplay so it can, so it easily one hundred percent convince convince me, you know, to actually to actually purchase this game. But the one thing I, I've I've actually noticed because I went into a bit more detail, but looking at the screenshot, if you look at the screenshots very carefully, you can see the riders are now wearing like like full futuristic body armor. Of course, of course, yeah. They, they wore the helmets back then, and then in, in the last two in the last two games, they had like um, what is it? They had like 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 skin tight aqua suits with long with like long um, biker gloves and biker boots. Um, this time, in, in well, in this in this game, that is, they're wearing like armor, literally, like similar to like like uh, like like Halo ish, Gears of War, um, Mass Effect type of armor. If 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 that if that's how you want to go with that that type, that type of route with it. But I'm wondering. I'm wondering if the custom. I'm, I'm actually wondering if the customization has actually gotten better. Um, you know, with uh, with, with with this game because I I, I, I mean, Colors and everything was amazing, but I really want this game. I really want you know, I really want Vector Unit to say to themselves, okay, I want I, we want the consumers to get more creative with with the, with the, not just not just the jet skis, but also the characters as well. You know, change different different plates of armor. You know, choose different helmets, choose different parts for um for your jet ski, make it look more awesome, look more badass. Um, you know, go online. You know, compete against multiple people online, and this this is why this is why you know this reason why Vector Unit needs to keep on making games like this with online multiplayer. Because for me, don't get don't get me wrong, I do enjoy playing Riptide GB two and Beach Buggy Racing uh, with my friends, obviously. Um, but at the same time, I really want to go against other people online because it's it's more challenging. It's you know it it, sh it shows you who, who's who's good at racing and who's not. You know what I mean? Um, because I, I do like a challenge when it comes to online. Because I, 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 even even if I win or lose, you know, I, I still say to myself, okay, that guy's pretty good, you know, that that guy was okay, and that guy was terrible. But you know, it it's it's it still it still brings the interest to 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 make you wonder how how um how is how's the online multiplayer going to pull off? Because you know they're bringing new game modes in, of course, for, for the online multiplayer. We're going to have you know regu regular racing. You know, going to have uh, elimination. Um, we're gonna have like a free freestyle, which they had in Riptide GP2, of course. Um, they're gonna have so many game modes, which I think I think it's just gonna blow everyone's mind into little pieces, if they're good. That is, um, mini games. I'm not so sure. I mean, if if they put like if they put like a like a Riptide GP uh, pinball game in there, or like or like one of those classic like eight bit racing games that that were that were played in the arcades, also on the Atari 2600, that would be really cool. Like like a like a like a parody of that. That would be cool. Um, but that, that's all. I, that's all the info I have. I have guys. So um, so don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Um, once once the trailer comes out, I will do a reaction video to that. And back to you, if you're watching this, you know I would. I really want to. I really want. I really want to hear more info and more news about this game, because the screenshot looks looks really good. I, I I really need to see the gameplay to actually make sure it actually convinces me to actually you know you know buy your game. So, uh, <laughs> okay, guys, peace out.